hopefully. guys out there that are making these vlogs, man, where you speed up the scenes when it's boring and slow it down and speed it back up again. It's badass. I love it. Uh, well, you're not sitting there at your computer for 20 minutes or your phone or whatever it is you're watching YouTube or on your TV. Bored to death. And it's kind of cool to watch. But the helmet mount on this thing It's pretty stable. Uh, it seemed to be. The uh, once I get the, the direction dialed in, the angle, I should say. But um, ah, hell, I lost my train of thought. There's Lane Motor Museum. That place is pretty cool. If you got ever in Nashville. And, Looking for something to do. It's a pretty neat place to check out. It's actually a guy's private auto collection. He needed a place to store his cars. Bought that place to store his cars. What the hell is this guy doing? And uh, he cycles through them. I guess that place has a basement that I've never been in where he stores. And he kind of swaps them out, so I don't think that you see the same vehicles all the time, which keeps it interesting. He's got some cool scooters in there, some cool bikes, some pretty nifty automobiles. There's downtown. You can see it to my slightly off to the right there. Where's this truck turning? There's nothing over there to turn into. Side street, maybe. I don't know. I'm going to right around this dude. That over there to the left. I believe it's dorm rooms for uh, Trevecca Nazarene College, if I'm not mistaken. I, could, uh, I may be mistaken, but I don't think I am. There's the Purity Dairies. It makes some great ice cream and milk. Green, buddy. It's green. There you go. There's another one without its lights on. A lot of, a lot of great drivers here in Tennessee. And here's a little bump coming up. Oh, there we go. Yeah. That was pretty easy. Here's uh, one of the f many projects in Nashville. We put new facades on the front doors to make them look more appealing. I don't know if you talk to anybody who ever lived in those things. Uh, they lose their appeal very quickly. 
but home to a lot of folks. Come on, brother. You can turn in there faster than that, can't you? Ooh, that'd be a hell of a great to fall into you. All right. This is not the uh, more luxurious side of town. I guess you figured that out. There are some really, really nice parts of town, or outskirts of town. What the hell are you doing, dude? What the fuck are you doing? Another brilliant driver from Tennessee. Realize he missed his turn and his, uh, comes to a dead stop at a green light. That's freaking awesome. Lucky my son didn't get rear-ended and I didn't get rear-ended. Now we got another one over here. This is great. Brilliance. Just freaking brilliance. Hey! Turned his light off. Now, let's just see what Mr. Toyota Sequoia is going to do here. Okay, he turned his turn signal off too. Now, now what are you gonna do, bud? How are you gonna screw me this time? Oh yeah, I wanted to go right, but now I'm gonna go left. Brilliance knows no bounds. Here's downtown right in front of us, and we will be turning here shortly. Right up here, actually. There's a Peabody. I think we need to turn this away. <sighs> I haven't been downtown in a while. Hermitage Avenue. That's the uh, walking bridge, they call it now. Titan Stadium right behind it. I need to go down another block and then hang a right. Cut myself short. Now I'm pulling somebody else's stupid maneuvers. And here I am bitching about them. Well, that's typical, isn't it? You always complain about somebody else doing something stupid. When we do it, we don't fess up to our own faults. I try to. I'm not always successful, that's for damn sure. That's kind of a nice shot of downtown, sort of.
Pinnacle building, the Batman building behind it. Can't really see it. Everybody calls it the Batman building. It's historic downtown right that way, but we've got to cut and go across the river over to the east side. And there is right on red. Uh, obviously, this guy's not turning right, even though he's supposed to. Come on, dude. Really? strikes in the background, all that shit. That's pretty cool. You pay attention to this guy who's creeping. Alrighty. As I suspected, it's completely freaking dark. I can see really well through the shield, though. So the shield's not too damn. Crossing over the interstate there, a lot of folks going home, still. And we're back to another project on the east side, moving on up. Actually, now that I've been riding in this uh, cooler weather, it's not that bad. I mean. I'm cold, but I'm not like freezing my ass off or nothing. Well, my fingers are pretty numb, but I think if I'd have put my leather gloves on over these, I'd have been fine. Yeah, we probably got about a mile to go and we'll be where we need to be. to go. Destination Street. How far off are we? <laughs> Half an hour. Hope Junior's still hanging around. It would really suck if he wasn't. So that was my little trip to Nashville, Tennessee from Smyrna, Tennessee. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, video's not quite over. Hope if that is if my GoPro is still working. I wonder how the cold temperatures affect it. Oh, hell, I see videos of people on snow covered mountains skiing and all that shit, so I don't imagine 50 degree weather and 30 degree weather is gonna phase it. Unless it got fogged up. No, 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 it shouldn't get fogged up. Alrighty. This cat is... 
Uh, little workout station here. Take off there. You can turn this time for real, or are you just fooling with me again? Huh? I look like you are. If I can spot Junior's place with the lights off, well, it's going to be close. There it is. What am I hitting here? I'm barely catching this. Ugh. You're on video if that is if my camera's still working. <laughs> the USB drive. Yeah, my USB thumb drive. I was oh no.